Okay. Hello and welcome. It is I, Tristan, Shagwazir. And I haven't streamed a single player game in a while. But with the release of the revamped Dead Space, the EA, I felt that it was time to break that fast. And, uh, I've gone through and I've done all the settings, so hopefully we can just jump right into it. But I'll start by saying Dead Space is one of my favorite single-player story games, like, ever. I had so much fun with it. I love the, the characters and the just the setting and the feel of all of it. And, uh, so when they announced that they were going to vamp up the graphics and release it again, I was pretty excited. And so now we'll see how that goes, if what they change, what they don't change. And uh, I'm just excited to see what happens. So let's uh, let's go. Let's do this. And I'll probably like tweak audio levels and positioning of things as I go because I'm still getting a feel for this. The oh, brightness, uh, adjust the brightness until the image on the left is barely visible. Okay. My God, the difference between 49 and 50 is ridiculous. How is that? What? It's just gone. Alright, we're gonna go with 50, because 49 uh, doesn't work, apparently. Let's go. Resume. 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 Kellyan en route to the Aegis system. Isaac Clark, Kendra Daniels, Zach Hammond, and some military ranked people like a corporal. I think it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Strange. Such a little thing. Nicole? Yeah. First I've heard from her in weeks. We're five minutes out, you still got that thing on repeat? Guess you really miss her. Bishamer is not a job you turn down, but six months apart with only vid calls? It's rough. Easy to say the wrong thing. I don't blame you. I'd listen to my girlfriend over Hammond reciting security protocols. Forewarned is forearmed, Miss Daniels. So you keep saying. Here we go. Nice clean re-entry. I like this. I like the uh turn the camera. Maybe just a little amp up. Imagine six months staring at that chunk of rock. Oh. To an independent miner. That's paradise. Aegis 7 is one of the richest finds in CEC history. Some prospecting team set up for life. Now where is she? Thank you. Know. This is a lot like the opening of the original. <clears throat> what a beauty. Biggest planet cracker in her class, you know. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it so dark? We should be able to see her running lights. Yeah. I'll get us into hailing range. Someone's got to be waiting up for us. Just be careful on the approach. I'm not taking any chances with the CEC's pride and joy. No chances, huh? Is that why you were digging into my personnel files before we left? You track your file access? I'm a computer analyst. It comes with a job. I ran standard CEC background checks, Miss Daniels. If you want to work in the big leagues, you have to play ball. <coughs> Sir, we're in ailing range. USG Ishimura, this is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kelly responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. Ishimura, do you copy? Come in. This is a USG Kelly. You ever hear of a full communications black on a one of these things? Never. Come on. Someone picked up the damn phone. Those are some fun noises. <coughs> uh, sounds like their communication array is busted. Maybe a broken encoder. Daniels and I can handle it in 48 hours, max. Hey, that gives you plenty of time to catch up with Nicole. Yeah. I hope so. Jen, Johnson, take us in. Gravity tethers engaged. Automated 
docking. Well, that's not supposed to happen. Stabilizer, Isaac. I like I that. Read the manual. What the fuck's going on with flight control? That guidance system's a death trap. Better add it to your repair list. Jen, what's our damage? Calm her down. We lost a poor booster. Got a fire in one of the stabilizers and singularity course of mess. Could be worse, but not by much. And let's get some help. Johnston, stay with the Kellyan. We'll send a medic. Everyone else, with me. I like the addition of him um, noting, you know, what uh, what to do to try and stabilize and all that. Just because you got, you know, the original game is you're there to fix things. He's an engineer, and it's like that's kind of all sad. And obviously, you go and you fix the ship, so it is also established well. It's just nice to have some How's your ankle? extra it's like hell. moments like that. What have I worse? You go on. I'll get it strapped up. Doesn't necessarily need flight experience to be able to say, you know, hey, maybe that'll slow us down. <laughs> but it just kind of shows a, a breadth of his knowledge and why he would be on this mission. More than just his connection to one of the people on the ship. Where is everybody? Half the ship must have heard that landing. Be proud, Chen. You gotta see her in one piece. Johnson might disagree. But you're off to buy the first round. I wouldn't mind something to study my nerves, especially on CEC's tab. You see anyone in flight control? No, nobody. Oh, that's probably flight control up there. Hmm. At least we didn't take out the sign. <laughs> I'm special. Modules from Acting Chief Engineer Jacob Temple. Oh, that's Location. new. Error. Employee not found. That's not good either. I can't read security. Same for the Chief Engineer. What is wrong with their comms? Oh, I guess everybody got like a special message in their own comms, telling them where to go, who to talk to. That's neat. Little, little changes and updates. I like it so far. Wow, you know, this whole area looks very true to the original. Mm, fun. It's real. A lot of the original sound design. Someone left in a hurry. Where's the security detail? Where's anybody? There's nothing logged. No duty roster, no power to the elevator. For God's sake. That security console is still working. Isaac, get a damage report. 
I'm done playing around. Look here, look here. X is right. You didn't. I'm trying to remember. Oh. Does anyone else smell that? Smell what? Like something died in the air vents. Oh. Oh. Okay. You can't hold it like you used to be able to. It looks like it doesn't have the Dead Space 2 upgrade where you Maybe could rotate. At least not yet. Sounds a little. Try that security console. I'm gonna do it. Hold on. I'm exploring the new functionalities and such. There's something on the floor here. Is that? I, I need that damage report. I mean, blood. Don't rush me. Woof. Oh God, that smell. What have you got, Isaac? Shit. It's not just comms with the guidance system. Half the Ishimura's in the red. Engines, hull, the trams. You could do that kind of damage to a planet cracker. Sabotage. Okay, got us the power. Ventilation's up. Power to the elevator should be. Hazardous anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. Uh oh. Another malfunction? No. The quarantine systems are all fine. Wait, do you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I hear it. Amen. Take it easy. Daniels, get those elevators running. There's something in here with us. What the? Ooh, oh, shit. Chen, no! Got the elevators open, and they got away. Nice. Now it's just me here. Oh god! No, I don't want to be with the monsters. Oh, it's locked. Uh, punch! You can't punch. Uh, uh, oh, I fucked up. I have fucked up royally. I can't stomp. I can't punch. I can't move past this thing. I need this chair to move. How did I fuck up like this? Move. <laughs> There we go. I went the wrong way. Ugh. It was like the opening to two. Only in two, I somehow managed to make all the right turns at the right times and not get stuck like that. I can't run. Why can't I run? There we go. Decided not to let me run. Where's the button? Where's the button? There we go. Gonna do the thing? No? Oh, there it goes. And then go close. Lovely. Goodness. Well, I'm already covered in blood. But we'll take this moment to say the graphics are looking nice. Okay, well, so, can't punch, can't stomp. That one always confused me, that you just couldn't, uh, couldn't defend yourself. Give me this. Let's see if they gave me the real laser dots back. like they did. I loved Dead Space 2 a lot, but one thing that kind of disappointed me, there we go, got my stompies, uh, was that they had changed the laser reticule uh, to just be a static reticle at the beginning of, at the middle of the screen, rather than being actually projected by the weapon and able to display differently on different surfaces. Although, it does look like you have lost the uh, the intrigue of having one dot on one surface and another dot on a different surface. Like I can't just get the top dot there. It starts with the middle dot, which you could do in the original game, but that's okay. That's a minor, minor thing. Let's see if I can punch. There we go.
Okay, already dealing with armored ones. That's gonna suck. Sorry, buddy. I don't want you coming after me. Got anything? We still don't have... the ammo. Can't move this. No stasis or kinesis yet. Hello, Edison Ma23. How are you doing today? I'm exploring Dead Space, the, the, the new release, because I loved the first one, and so I obviously have to play the new one. <gasps> Do I have mail? Security request retrieved. Nice. It didn't die. We shot that fucker right between the eyes, and it didn't die! Smith had to shoot its fucking arms and legs off! For God's sake, send help! What? You mean that I should remove their limbs? Is that is that what you're trying to tell me? Body looks safe. <gasps> Healing! F? Oh man, I might have to change that. I think it used to be Q. What's Q now? Whoopsie. Hello, Reg. Got a gun. Oh, the gun now takes up an inventory slot. I liked that it didn't in the original game. <laughs> so you could have whatever guns and they'd only be on the weapon wheel. They wouldn't actually be taking up slots. Boo. That's a change I don't love. Alright, let's just quickly... What is Q doing? Q is, uh... Roll left and zero G? Okay, so maybe... F. Pack rig link. Uh, I mean, used to have an F is kinesis. I don't know. I kind of like. I don't know why they stuck those two together. Like, oh, am I not able to change it here? No, T customize. T is controller customization. What? You know what? Never mind. Never mind. It's fine. F is fine. Uh, I'm not untangling that web now. Alright, who's here? Who's here and needs to have their legs removed? <gasps> Friends! Isaac. Oh my god, Isaac. You made it. Hi. Trust. They're everywhere. Shit, is he, uh... He's gone. Nothing I can do. Fuck. What the fuck are these things? The ones I saw... Some of them were wearing Ishimura uniforms. They're the crew? How the hell can they be the crew? Look at them. We need to get to the bridge. There's a thousand people on board. Someone will be there. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of the quarantine. And you're both repair techs. So how do we do this? Two repair techs, two military. Yeah. There's a broken tram car blocking the tunnel. It's gridlocked the system. And the data board's burned out. I can't lift the lockdown or call the tram until we get a spare from the maintenance bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of the quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And Isaac? Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's a doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Ah, thank you for trying to assure me of things. She always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. And off they go. Get the tram running. We can do that. What's we got? Got some. Ooh, a save station. Yeah, let's definitely do that. Save. Save. Yes. Sweet. Unlock door there. There's an unlock door there. Let's go through that door, so we'll go through that door, probably. But first, what's this? Hello. Ram network circuit. Data board needed. Okay. This is where I deliver it once I have it. Got it. And obviously this one here. Okay, 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 okay. Wants me to go that way, so we're gonna go this way. Because that is how you dead space. Alright, who's here? Who's here? Who's here? Who's near me? Baggage, baggage, baggage. Oh yeah. This is gonna be bad. Ooh, money. I'm sure that's fine. Beaten. 
intestines. <gasps> okay. Yay. Build up no power. What else we can find in here? Hey! This is that door where I saw a monster go by. Cut off limbs. Got it. They did? Good boy. Got ten ammo. Is that all we got? No, we still have some more. Good. Alright, that's all that's back here. Was something that we tried to... Wait a minute. There's a breaker. Oh, you can only have one on at a time. Okay. Start with that one. Oh, go away. Oh, hi. Okay, okay. No. Ammo! Yay! Where did you come from? What did I power up? Okay, there's some power. I powered up this. Who's here? Nice. Power node. Ah. Coming in? Gonna drop in somewhere else? Is that just to scare me? Good conductor. Very nice. Alright, I guess they're not coming in. Lockers! Money! Gun! And a power node. Nobody? 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 Okay. Got everything? Yes? Looks like it. Good. Alright. Are you there? Nope. Hey. Whoop. Whoop. Okay. Flip this over here. Another save station. Sign. Maintenance bay. Probably I should have done something that I didn't do. That's a good question, and one that, I guess, ultimately, doesn't matter what the answer is. Oh, man. Sucks to be you. Ammo. Well, I was hoping I could hit that fuel tank through the, uh, barrier there, but it didn't happen. God, they're really inundating me with ammo. I guess that's good. They very much expect me to be just, like, wasting it, shooting all over the place. Or, I mean, not me, but the player. There you are. Find me? No? Okay. Uh, sucks to be you. Wait, can I? No, there you are. Man, I like those. Those were there in the first game, but I don't think they were so abundant or so useful. I want that. Which means I need to get through a door. There. I need power. Power is what I need. Getting money, which is excellent. Means I'm not using up inventory slots on my wealth. Got that semiconductor. Doing really well. 51 me. Oh, does it just tell me what my total ammo is for the gun? Like, right over it? <gasps> Big health hack. Oh, 
What do we got? Might be too soon to be in here. I didn't go the way it wanted me to go. <laughs> uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Find out. Any of those? Do with that. Yeah, I think it might just be. Might just be too. Something. Elevator. Oh, there's already away we go. Ah such clean lines. I like the graphics upgrade. Alright, who's here? Who's here that wants to eat me? Cause it ain't gonna happen. No, no, no. You have a light dims out right as I get here. There's the busted thing. Need to get rid of that. There's the power. It's not powered. I don't trust that you're dead. There, now I trust that you're dead. Okay. It's gonna be another one of those. You can only have so many on. Alright, what we got here? Oh, a text log. I only ever use two guns, but it's gonna bug me until the end of the game. Uh, but I don't. Uh... Oh, here we go. Look at all this. Nope. No, no, no. I did it wrong. Isaac, don't bother shooting those fuckers in the head. Got it. Ugh, buttons. It's the repair envoys. Air trim system. Okay, I'll run. Chris, it's still after us! Run! Okay. Uh, alright. Mm -hmm. Good thing nothing decided to eat me while I was fucking around in my menus. Alright. Yes, we're gonna fuck with this. What's that even doing? We just uh, turn this one off. Turn this one on. Oh, that was the lights. Right. Now it's all dark and scary. Have all of them on? Yeah. What did I turn off? Turned off whatever that is. I don't know what that is. If I turned on, this is. I also kind of like that they kept the... In one, you had to hit them again after they were... I think it was in one and not two. It was different in the two games. In one, it was one way. In the other, it was the other way. And I can't remember which is which. It's been too long. But in one of them, I think it was the first one, you had to hit them again after they were dead to make uh, goodies pop out. Oh, that's where this goes. Oh, did I just shut off the elevator on myself? I fucking did. <sighs> All right, we're gonna get rid of the lights. The lights are less important. Because we need 
the other two power. My bad. Turn that off, turn that on. We don't need the lights. It's fun. Is that an extra body? Was that always there? Is that always there? I feel like these bodies are moving around a bit after I kill them. <laughs> have elevator and probably the power to the thing that'll move the tram out of the way. But no lights. And we always ready. Or you know. Ready more of the time than you're not. Things. Yeah. Oh, God, got so much ammo. This is why I don't care about like putting the extra bullets in them. Now then, where's the uh where's the uh this way? Oh there, it opened the door. Ugh. Sometimes I hit shift to run, and it doesn't do it, like, if I'm still putting plasma cutter down from the aim. That's what keeps messing me up. Hey, alright. Another node, a mod station? We're doing great. We're good. What are you? The data board I need. We can't stay here much longer. Hearing a lot of movement. Eh, yeah. Halfway done. Found a data board. We just gotta move the tram. Okay. Daniels, watch that door. <laughs> Doing amazing. What does that say? Oh, it's written in marker language, isn't it? No, it says something is to survive. To join is to survive. Got it. Do, do, do. Does it look like I got all the stuff? Nice thing is that most pick upables glow. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Upgrade weapons and rig using the bench. Weapons, improve selected, unlock new upgrades. Improve the selected weapon rig capabilities by investing power nodes to gain access to unique upgrades. Expand the weapons upgrade graph. Bring upgrade parts. So that's new. There were not upgrade parts originally. Even both of the other games, I believe. Because it was just... You would find, um... Two introduced the variant items. Or you would have to find a... A special blueprint to build the, uh, like, one that dealt more fire damage or electricity damage or something like that, stuff like that. Um, I mostly didn't use the special ones, but there were a bunch of special ones. Raids can be reset at any time for credits. Alright, well, I love plasma cutter. I don't get to use the mouse for this system. We have two nodes. What can the suit do? Eh. Okay. Up HP, up air. Those are both good things. Like, very little. Oh, whoa. This is all we have. Size? Stasis zone size? Interesting. Wow. You've got not a lot of options until you get those upgrade parts, huh? Plasma kind of got. Damage and capacity we would get. Also, both really good things. Mm, let's start with the suit. I like that they color-coded them, so that you always know that you're grabbing... It used to be the whole thing was blue, so you really had to pay attention to what the letters were. Like, oh wait, I didn't want capacity, I wanted damage in this world. Now they've color-coded the nodes, so that you shouldn't get them confused as easily. Excellent. All right. Up to my survivability. Probably gonna throw a beastie at me. There you are. And there you go. Oop, there it goes.
Alright. I swear you weren't that close to me when I killed you. I'm telling you, it moves the bodies around after they fall. Buddy! Alright, uh... X. That way. Now that I've, you know, gone all the wrong way. Probably the yeah, out the door. This door. I normally would have been smarter about that. Checked it before I got that close to it, but I didn't. That's on me. This can probably stay the way it is. I don't think. It's oh, hold on. The concern is always that while you're shooting the one in front of you, one pops out behind you. So very often you'll see me shooting one, shoot it a couple times, and then move toward it. As it becomes less of a threat, I want to make sure that one isn't about to gouge me from behind. X. Has to go that way, but originally I was supposed to go this way, so why do I not need to go this way anymore? Am I just supposed to go this way and be like, uh, what? I guess I can't do the thing. Hey, Stasis. Alright. Stasis was C, right? <laughs> That's what... <laughs> it would have been a lot less threatening going the other way if I had that already. Uh, it's fine, it's fine. It's all fine. <laughs> Alright, Chunky. Okay, Stasis recharge. Malfunction between you and the maintenance bay. Yeah, it's crazy, it? isn't it? No, but I found a stasis module. If I'm faster than. I got it. <laughs> uh, if I'm faster than the last guy. Security clearance required. Alright, let's see. So I guess I'll just get it all done at once. So, how? Stasis recharge. Put that in the old inventory. Air station. It's great thinking back to when I streamed the first Dead Space initially, and I would just go from station to station because, like, I was limited to like ten minutes. Whispers have started. Totally quiet and normal before. I found a man inside the vents. Or what time? Not chain. Ooh, here's the thing. Why are you moving? I don't like that. Or a harpy. Regular hands, regular hands. 
I always gotta do the hand check. It's like checking for AI art. We check the hands. Do they have blades for hands? No? Okay, it's just a body. Money. Alright. Maybe I should have put that board in first after all. Oh yeah. On the old inventory. They're getting a little tight. A lot of ammo. Two heals. We're not healing. It might be now that I find out I should have uh, installed that board. I can't, like, do the thing until I do... You know, at some point, it's gonna be saying... Wad disengaged... Hey, look! Somebody who's dressed like me! Oh, not your luck. Message retrieved. Benson to engineering. You got a stasis module handy? We need one in tram maintenance stat. The autoloader's fried. I got a damaged tram car on the tracks, and if the whole system's gridlocked, guess who they're calling? Several here are sending a stasis module now. What happened to the autoloader? No idea. A lot of shit's been breaking down. I keep hearing things. Down in the gears where no one can be. You know? I know. <laughs> Temple sounds a little disinterested. I know. Okay, buddy. Be here. Prepare systems online. Loading system reinitialized. Hey, fucked up tram. Warning. Autoloader malfunction. I know. Please contact a repair technician. I am the repair technician. Annually. Wait, am I able to do that without, uh. I don't have, um, kinesis. I feel like I need kinesis. Uh, uh, oh, me? Nice. Locked doors, lights. Alright, let's go attach them. Put the board in the thing with the play. Oh, wait, here we go. Good. Oh, hi. All good. All good. Alright, let's do that again. Sub up. Go. Good. Oh, we're not good. Something finally hit me. I didn't follow my own rule. Alright, now to find out if I just press F which one it uses, because I've got a medium and a small. And one of the games used from the smallest first, and then used larger ones. And then, the, I believe, two did larger ones before smaller ones when auto-choosing. So, eh. Which one is it? It was smaller. Okay. And initiate. Replacing damaged tram car. Please stand by. Uh, please stand by, huh? What's gonna try and eat me while I'm standing by? You know, there's loud noises that'll cover up the approach of a monster. See? See? Told you. Goodness gracious. There's so many people that want me. Such a desirable man. Alright. That's all taken care of. I could fucking engineer in my sleep. Huh. One. Just one. Okay. 
can. Alright. Look at us. Look at we. You got it. The camera's jamming the whole system. I'm heading back to tram control. Should be able to call you a ride to the bridge. Good. Just hurry. I keep hearing noises right under our feet. Oh. Alright. I'll get you a ride. You keep hearing noises right under your feet. I like that they're talking about it. Like, man, it almost sounds like there's monsters here that we need to watch out for. And I'm just fucking going to town on monsters. And he's not even mentioning it to them. He's like, oh yeah, I had to kill my way through a whole bunch of these fucked up monsters just to do all this. Nah. <laughs> Something's in here. I don't like any of these noises. All these noises suck. Oh, there it goes. I look like a leaper. Probably the turlet. Oh wait, my turn was here. Yeah, here we go. Right, you're still just a body, right? You're not a problem? Good. Oh, hi. You've got more health and you spit. I don't like that. I was a little overconfident there, just firing off the two at its leg. Should have stasised it. Alright, I'll learn. Hello, Teddy. Over there. I guess I could save station first. It doesn't really matter. The hope is that this game looks beautiful and runs very smoothly forever because I installed it to my NVMe drive. Data board reinstalled. Alright. System restart complete. Let's do the thing. Let's do the thing. Maintenance complete. Calling tram. Tram en route. It's clear! Hello. Now arriving at flight deck tram control. They're on. Bye bye. We're on board. Something hit the roof, but it seems operational. Quarantine lockdown is lifted, so you can get to the hangar. Comms are still down, though, so be ready for anything. What's the plan? You and Johnson fix up the Kelly. We report to the bridge. Standard emergency protocol. What protocol? Hammond, people are dying here. And I'm not losing anyone else. Ah. We'll stick to procedure. We're getting the fuck out. Cool. Return to the Killian. Oh shit. Did I just... Okay, good, I didn't. I meant to hit X, not C. Go back that way. Uh... Well, I did both of those, so, yeah. Away we go. Sure, it'll be fine. Normal hands, red light. Totally normal light. I assume I can be hovered over what everything is going on, but I haven't honestly been checking, which is bad of me. Hello. Um.
Oh, right. I get to go back this way. Hmm. Wait, I'm going up? Was I going up before or going down before? I don't I remember. Oh, he's back. Okay, then. Give me another one. Yep. Find me. worth it. No matter what else we find in here. Oh gosh, I'm gonna run out of space. Oh, stop finding ammo. Okay. I guess we're okay. We're using ammo at a good rate. Behind me. Why didn't you drop anything? Let me get. Let me see it. Oh, I kept shooting him. <laughs> Look, <laughs> nothing came out. <laughs> he might still be alive. Wow. Dark, dark, dark. Okay. Isaac, we made it to the bridge. It's... There's no survivors. Daniels is trying to get into the command computer. Cool. Alright, run quickly. Lower this to 80. Just to make sure that the game isn't drowning me out. Except... <clears throat> what do we got? Because I didn't, also didn't want to drown out the game or the game to be too much quieter than me, but I... Definitely... Ooh. Okay. Definitely don't want the uh, game drowning me out. Beginning. Here? No. Alright, go back to the Kellyan. Yes, Dad. Doesn't look too good in there. See if I can help the personnel. Got it. I swear it looks worse inside. Hi! Okay. Thing got fucked up. What'd you say? What have you got on you? Is that blood? Haley, I need you to listen. The Ishimura's overrun with the fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? No, the comms are still out. Isaac... We need the Killian fixed now. Got a damage report? Yeah, it, it's there.
Whoa! Damn it. I was gonna help her. Ah! Why is everything exploding? Why does everything I love explode? Oh Jesus, it's it's the engine's activated. Hits, huh? Take off your tail just in case. There we go. Hey, buddy. That's fine. You're gonna leap? There you go. I keep hitting X. Not dead yet. There you go. Isaac, what's happening? Yeah. Dustin's gone. Kelly and Till. The Singularity Core overloaded. No! Kelly and was our only way home. We're trapped. No! I'm not losing two good people for nothing. Oh, yeah. What about the command computer? It's a brick. All the primary systems are locked down with the captain's codes. So we find Captain Matthias. Track his rig. Okay. Okay, here. Captain Benjamin Matthias. Location medical. Status deceased? Even the captain? God. Isaac, you're closer to medical. You can double back and cut through maintenance. Find the captain's body and get his rig. With his codes, we... What was that? Chen? I'm sure that's fine. Another thing that I uh, am enjoying a lot about this one is that um, in the original, Isaac was almost completely silent throughout the game, just um, just being basically being told what to do by everybody. Uh, didn't really have a lot of his own personality there. He didn't really get the personality until two. I really enjoyed too because pretty much every time somebody said something to me, I would snarkily say something back at them, and then Isaac would say the same thing. I'm like, cool, <laughs> we're on the same page. It's nice that you know he actually shows concern and and is making suggestions and like has agency. Like shit's still happening to you, and you really don't have much choice about how you go about it because it's it's a linear story, but. He at least appears to have some agency and some thought behind what's going on, which was definitely um, lacking a little in the original. You know, him responding to like, oh man, even the captain's dead? Wow, I don't remember that baby being there. That, uh, I don't remember that. <laughs> Sticking things in here. That also wasn't there, because I would have picked that up. That's a ruby, isn't it? Oh, it's a text log. Oh, okay. So if I touch nothing, it just automatically opens. Article is sponsored by CEC Print Division. May not represent the views of an amazing universe magazine. Imagine a world where basic resources like fuel, ore, metals, and ice are hard to come by. Imagine if humanity's needs were entirely dependent on the nearly extinct resources of Earth and the dwindling supplies of the colonies. Older readers don't need to imagine such a world. You lived it less than a century ago. Looking at the star looking to the stars for additional resources was nothing new, but at the time, the only shock point capable ships were smaller vessels that could barely keep up with demand. Enter the Ishimura. Named after the celebrated astrophysicist and inventor of the shock point drive, Hideki Ishimura, uh, the USG Ishimura was the first uh, of the massive planet cracker ships built in 2446. She has enjoyed a long and storied career. The Ishimura was the first vessel of her size to utilize a shock point drive for large scale commercial deep space expeditions. At her inception, the Ishimura was hailed as the savior of the colony as she was created to mine and process asteroids and even small moons with remarkable efficiency. She was also the first ship capable of pioneering scan and catch technique for harvesting mineral rich asteroids. Utilizing huge gravity tethers, the Ishimura could lock onto asteroids, pull them inside the ship's massive collection bays for quick and efficient smelting. 
At 62 years old, the Ishimura is still in remarkable shape. Her equipment has been upgraded over the years. Many of her interior spaces have been retrofitted to take advantage of the current technology of technological advances. Despite so many long years of service, she remains the pride of the CEC fleet and is still the company's largest planet cracker. Whenever a vital, de vital deep space mining project requires skill, experience, and dedication, the Ishimura is ready to answer the call. It is ships like the Ishimura and the dedication of men and women to Hokur, who crew her that built the Concordance Extraction Corporation into the trusted, dependable resource provider it is today. Yay, capitalism. Alright, well, that's a door that wasn't open before, and it's the way it wants me to go. Uh, yeah, I'm okay with this. I am less okay with this. Hello. Go this way. I need a potty break anyway. Save yourself. Love it. Dark and there are squelchy noises. I don't like it. Ah, can book. Okay. Got some money. Turlets. Well, I'll say this for this bathroom. At least there weren't any bodies. There's blood. There aren't any bodies. There were bodies in the last one, and that was bad. This one, no bodies. Much better bathroom. I'd give it 7 out of 10. Alright. Get a little nose scratch in there before we go through this door. Oh, it is a tram. Crap, an elevator. They're going down, I guess? They're going, looks like up. No, down. Okay. Ugh, whoop. All right. Oh, nice a store. Uh, a couple of bodies. A door. No tram. Store. A locker. Some bags. All right. Plasma energy. Okay, I am gonna get loaded up on med packs. That's for sure. Three smalls and one medium, huh? Did I use my other medium? I thought I had two mediums. Maybe it just uses what it thinks is necessary. That was interesting. The body. Okay. Alrighty. What are you? Where are you? Scan rig to unlock workstation. Who's rig? I have a rig. Oh, yeah, yeah. Scan rig to unlock workstation. Right, let's start here. Maybe we can get a new suit. In the store, items can be purchased with credits, bring schematics to the store to gain access to new items. From the inventory, you can sell currently held items, place them in storage, and storage. When the inventory is full, place items in storage to retrieve or sell later. Okay. Bonus content is available. Check your storage. Oh, uh, an infested suit. That's cool. Uh, lone survivor suit. Interesting. Uh, bloody suit. Excellent. Uh, sanctified suit. Okay. Venture suit. Alrighty. Okay, that's a little outside my price range. Here we got small med pack, which I don't need. Alright, E. Inventory. Let's sell some stuff. Starting with you. Sell. We always appreciate your business employee name. Okay. Sure. Now we're over 10,000. Probably what I'll do... Get a store, right? Oh, I just have all the... I don't have to buy them or anything. I think... 
I think I'm going to try and maintain that first playthrough feel. Because uh, I remember when they gave you these bonus content suits in 2. And so when you went to the store for the first time, it's just like, here you have all these. Um, and because the suits were just cosmetic, like the upgrades were to the rig, not to the suit, you automatically got, like, the fully upgraded rig capacity, which kinda took away that whole survival, like, inventory management aspect of it, which... And then you didn't feel like you were really upgrading after that, you know, you... You just got the better armor from the new suits, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna leave those alone for now. Uh, Q. I don't remember what the button to store things is. Like, I can go and visit the storage. It doesn't say anything. Oh, it's just enter, isn't it? Like, I could get rid of this. Yeah, move to storage. Okay, sell that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo. Let's store this, just in case, and let's store one of these, just in case. That kind of frees up some inventory space, and yeah, that'll be good. Just because I can remember going in real confident, <laughs> uh, and then finding out, oh, uh, I used up... Increases your inventory to capacity and provides 5% armor. Yeah, not a reason not to do that. I got 12, so that'll be one more row of slots. Let's grab that. Quantity, unique, cost 10. Do it. I would have illuminated myself, but my ring light decided to die a while back. I guess I can turn my light on. Alright, level 2 suit. Little bitty bits of armor on it. Alright, let me turn the lights on. So bright! <laughs> Normally I'm all about that, like, all the money goes to power nodes. But, uh, what a suit's available. That gets priority. Alright, does that count as scanning my reg? No. Fuck. Alright, well, did that, did the store. This, that's where I was. This is where they were standing just recently. Or they went off to... Central Command. Alright. Please. Hop in a save. Let's go. Going for an hour. I don't want to stop. Hour is a nice, more bite-sized thing, but... Dang. L2 suit. Graph extended. Oh, okay. That's good to know. Nice. Okay. So that's better than... Alright, 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 alright. What is ERG? Stasis energy. Got it. Stasis duration. Stasis song. Got two nodes. Those aren't connected. We have to get more stasis energy, but that's not a bad idea. Man, what if I just keep upgrading the rig and I don't upgrade the gun at all? Just because, like... 
I'm bad. <laughs> yeah. Let's grab that energy so we can do more stasises. And let's make the stasis bigger. I'll do them eventually. I will. I'll do them eventually. Look at that. And it refilled my stasis, so I saved myself having to recharge my stasis. So, that was a good idea. I forgot. If you're out of ammo and you upgrade ammo capacity, you get one fill of ammo. So the same is true with stasis and stuff like that. Also, the... Now we have three rows. I don't like the word sorry in there. Sorry, this is about buying a house. Check on it. I'll get back to you. Okay. Well. Hopefully it's fine. You kinesis that thing right into yourself, didn't you, buddy? Aim and F. Oh, a chunky chunk room on top. Nice. Anything interesting? These are kinesisable. Okay. Just telling me that I don't have the clearance already. There you go. Oh, that looks interesting. Doink. Like that noise. Do 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 do. weird that she went to go T-pose. They all came back. <laughs> Wait, is that not her hand? Oh. 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 <laughs> I thought it was her. I don't want a pulse rifle. They never gave you a pulse rifle for free like this in the first game. Just one of the reasons I never used it. It's because I would have had to buy it. The other reason I never used it was because it sucks. Are those supposed to be used med? Oh man, she tried so hard. Those are all used med kits. A new weapon has been added. You can switch to the new weapon. Where is it? No key item sort. Down there. I can. But it's so not a good idea. 
Primary fire. Oh, there's a proximity mine? Wait, but there was a timed mine with a line gun. I'm just waiting for the line gun. That's the only one I really need. Alright, excuse me, bodies. I'm sorry. Are you wiggling because I touched you or because you're not dead? I honestly, this isn't answering my question at all. It's getting worse. What is happening? <laughs> Stop that. I'm gonna guess it was because I touched it. Save station. Override. Well, she said not to let them out. Maybe I should save before I let them out. Well, I honestly don't want the pulse rifle. We gonna save. Chapter one is done. Chapter two, intensive care. New arrivals, intensive care. So the, ch the, the chapter names have been kept. I love that. Human goo. Isaac, have you heard from Daniels? We were attacked. She ran the other way. No, nothing. Medical's a slaughterhouse. They barricaded access to the morgue. The morgue? Yeah. But the barricade was put together in a hurry. A hydrazine tank might blow it open. Just need a detonator, like maybe a shock pad. The coal could be through there if... Isaac. The one who attacked us. I swear to God it was Chen. But... I saw him die. If they barricaded the morgue, maybe it was to keep something in. There you go. Smart thinking. Oh. <laughs> We're not gonna go get the captain's rig. We're gonna go... Blow up this thing. Field medicine. Maybe I need to know some field medicine. Level two security clearance required. Really? That's new. At least I don't remember that being a thing. Save. Pretty much just save anytime I see a save station. Cause I am paranoid. About programs or computers crashing unexpectedly. Alright, I came in there, so I guess I could go that way, or I could go that way, and it wants me to go that way, so I guess I'm going the other way. Woo! Alright, I'm gonna put away this plasma rifle, because it's just gonna start taking up uh, space that I don't want to give it. Move it. Wow, you're not even allowed to sell it. Move. If I don't have the weapon with me, I will be less likely to find ammunition for it. I'll still find ammunition for it here and there, but it will mostly be in, like, amounts that you can just sell and not worry about. That was a little choppy. Didn't like that. No blades. Medical personnel dressed just like Nicole. Whoa. Whoa. Hailing a 
Come on. Oh yeah. You're fucked. Crazy things. Ugh, I'm hitting X again instead of C. Ugh, that has some good. That has some good, uh, Dead Space 2 feel to it. Oh, that didn't kill you. Huh. Oh. I don't know. Wait, it's... Lovely. I don't think that I should, like, move stasis to X, because I keep accidentally hitting X. Can't get in there until I lift the quarantine, so let's grab one of these. F is definitely for Hilariously funny to me. Riot. Quarantine lifted. Yeah, because I'm awesome. Ooh! What? That gave me back all my stasis? Wait, was there a oh. Ha! Ha ha ha! <laughs> I stuck him to a stasis recharge and I didn't notice it. <laughs> I thought it was just the quarantine lifting being friendly and giving me my stasis charge back. Oh, that was funny. Boop beep bop beep. Boop beep 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 beep. It's glowing. It's nothing. Dr. Kine, CSO, Chief Science Officer. Whoa. Ben, what in God's name is happening down there? Precisely that. God's work. How can you say that? These deaths at the colony, the paranoia, the hallucinations. You wanted a scientific analysis? Cause and effect? Well, it all began after they raised the marker. <clears throat> what are you so worried about? The marker is defined. We know this. Look, it'll be on board tomorrow. You can study it then. Put your mind at ease. At ease? People are dying. How can that be the transformation the teachings promise? We're witnessing a new beginning. 
experiments for unitology, for humanity. Of course our faith is being tested. Everything is about to change. That's what worries me. And recording. Seal entry. Well, his little marker statue is gone. What do we got? Bit logs from the colony are poor quality, but I've seen enough to confirm the discovery to Ben. That's like Spanish. And some gross noises. Enough to confirm the discovery to Ben, the artifact appears to be a genuine marker, the first to be found since Unitology's founding. We must get it on board at the first opportunity so I can begin a proper study. I can't even imagine the potential of such a find. The black marker offered revelations beyond our wildest dreams, and that was without the benefits of the current analytical technology. This new marker? What secrets could it have? What wonders could it offer to humanity, to the Church of Unitology, without EarthGov here to seize them first? This marker could herald the dawn of a new age, and I will do my part to see that age come to pass. Maybe this is fate. In the darkest time of my life, the church and its teachings comforted me, saved me. Now I'm here, in the right place at the right time, to be of service to all humanity, to repay those blessings. Amelia, only you could be here now. Oh boy, Kain. Join us in paradise. Kind, 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 kind. Kind. Oh, buddy. Alright. Up to now here, am I gonna get quarantined again? X. Go back up there, find the hydrazine. Uh, I think are like the paddles. Yeah. Oh man. A bunch of ammo. My inventory. <laughs> Alright, we're fine. Pick them up six at a time and they're what, 25 in a stack? Senior officer, counseling patient, so three transcript for patient, name redacted. Okay, dictation on. I'll keep your name out of the transcript, Jane Doe. Thanks, it's just so hard to remember what's real. Your church mentor talked to you again. He knows me and my girlfriend want to leave. I can feel it. Our last seminar was all about heretics. How every unitologist who leaves is an enemy of humanity. Unitology is big... It's big enough to take care of itself. This is about what's right for you. Just be careful. The church pulls out these tricks when they feel threatened. They have neuropsychiatrists, too. Even if you get out, they'll try to... Dr. Brennan? Sorry, I... Did something happen? I had two patients who... I tried. And her son tried so hard, but she... I will fight for you with everything I've got, but never underestimate how strong the church's pull can be. Wow. I love that. 
that was not in the first game. We get a little bit more depth on what Brennan actually did on the ship and how she interfaced with the unitologists and unitology. Personal log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. With medication and zero-G therapy, patient Harris is showing improvements. If this continues, there might be hope for the others on Aegis 7. However, Dr. Mercer continues to interfere. He claims Harris's delusions are religiously significant. If I have to make a complaint, I will. I'm not losing my patient over unitology bullshit. Not again. Tracking rig signal. Dr. Nicole Brennan. Rig location? Inconclusive. Fuck. Manual rig tracking is available. Really? Scientific method. Investigate emergency. Hydrazine, I think. Oh, so Nicole isn't here. I like this little ad. I like these changes. Oops, got a little bit worried there. Thought I strung him up right in front of the door. Schematic, nice, and I'll be able to buy stasis packs. Okay. Ooh, nice bench. Maybe it was like a six of one, a half dozen of the other kind of thing, where there's two ways to go up, and it really just wants me to go up. Alright, there it is. Stupid babies. Back. Those people might be alive. Those are babies. Shit. Not Nicole, is it? There isn't a way in. Everything's piled up in front of the door. If that's her. Looks bad. How can I know? It's fast. 
fascinating to me that, like, we got here in time for anyone to still be alive. Z Caswell from D. Leal. Clerical error. Zoe, specimen 426 is ready for harvest. I was about to notify Alvarez to prep the medical, uh, prep for medical leave. When I checked the database, I saw Ensign Sable has been moved ahead of her. That right. Alvarez has been on the waiting list for three months now. I thought arm transplants took priority, to, priority over a cornea. Regarding clerical error. Here's your clerical error. One of them brought CEC stock. Bought CEC stock at the last purchase. One didn't. Guess which one was suddenly bumped up to vital personnel. Not worth the headache to push back on it, trust me. And before you think about filing an ethics complaint, just remember the wise words of Hippocrates. Shit rolls downhill. I don't remember if it was Hippocrates who said that. <laughs> Go with it. Didn't. It was Hippocrates who said, do first, do no harm. I'm sorry, I'm just a little bit mesmerized by the dancing babies. They got some moves, okay? Will there be four of the babies? Oh, there will. Ah, son of a bitch. Oh, shit. Oh, those home men. Son of a gun. Ace. Good news. Might have been a small one. Yoink. that money glows green and healing items glow green because I keep thinking I'm finding a healing item being like, oh sweet, healing item. person looks absolutely cooked. Ugh, okay, that's not the way to do it. Apparently that's not the way to do it either. Okay. Daniels isn't answering her rig link. What's your status? Did you find Nicole? Her office is empty. No sign of her. But I found a shock pad I could use on the barricade. Just need a hydrazine tank. Hurry, Isaac. I don't like what I'm hearing out there. Not bad. Don't leave the hydrogen tank. <laughs> I also forgot that I hung you up in front of the door. Well, at least those bodies aren't moving. that way. Using their cut off limb is as effective as a voice. No, no, it just I had the entire arm instead of just the blade. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. I really do keep hitting X instead of C. What fucking. Oh, 
scroll down far enough, maybe? Oh. Now I see how it is now. There. Okay. Use stasis. Okay. I'm back. Stasis. If I say X, does anything else change? My other X stay there? Stays there. I just, I keep hitting X when I want to hit C, so I should just move it. Blueprint. Oh. Man. That's still ten thou. What have we got? Back to storage. Two of those, two of those. What do you for? They're cool, but no, 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 no. from when I download ring data, but I mean, like, if I go straight to Captain Matthias, then, like, I hit the wrong button! Maybe I should change that, too. You know what? Let's just go ahead and do that. Let's just go ahead and do that. You are now X... You are now the save these changes. That seems better to me. Let's find out. to break your skull. Wow. He'd been beating his head against the wall long enough that he'd rubbed away all of the flesh on the front of his skull. Holy crap. Holy crap! Oh, yeah. Just used up my stasis. Glove dispenser, nice. 
glove candy dispenser. You glove flavor. Okay then. Just so many things are covered in blood. How do people have this much blood? that is powering something over there. Let's find out. Maybe it's that door. That'd be nice. It is that door. Isn't that nice? Maybe there's a power node in here. Level two, security Can you fly? Patient log retrieved. I hear the tests on patient Harris were inconclusive. Given the reports from the colony, he's lucky to have his faculties at all. Well, a divine experience would leave an impression on anyone's mind. Perhaps. But I saw nothing divine in all that... blood. The suicides. This is a revelation, Terence. We just need more insight to... translate it. You think this insight can be found in Mr. Harris's psyche? I'm positive. And with Captain Matthias barring any visits to Aegis 7, this fellow may be our best chance. Harris is Dr. Brennan's patient. And your methods... Look, Mercer, things are complicated enough already. I can't sign off on this. You'll do what's best, of course, but... How long can we afford to wait? Me. That's O2. That ain't the hydrazine I need, I guess. Alright, well, that was going to be an interesting experiment. See if I died. <laughs> See if the plasma cutter could ignite the oxygen. Tank is a perfect pressure vessel. It would have exploded. Let's do this. Oops. Oh, that ain't powered. Up we go. Oh. Is it a baby? Nope. It's worse. It's already missing its tail, though. What we got? No. Yes. <clears throat> back. Spent on it. area has been rearranged. I remember this part in the first game. Oh, I didn't need to do that. I could have just walked over there. Okay. Some more heads for you.
thought I saw something. Unfaithful. That way. Hmm. Critical log. Dr. Warwick. Diagnoses are stacking up as fast as I can file them. Sleep paralysis, hallucinations, nightmares, paranoia. I'm getting patients from all over the ship. No underlying cause is showing in environment analysis, but foodstuffs or radiation levels. I admit, I'm at a loss. Mercer says he and Kine are working on a hypothesis, so in the meantime, I'm treating the symptoms. Seeing some improvement with sensory deprivation treatments and our zero-G therapy pods, but the sheer number of patients we're managing bothers me. Those systems are old, and they need an overhaul. With so many pods active, I worry what might happen if there's a serious power surge down there. Nothing else seems to help. Suppose the odds are low enough. I'd rather take a small, calculated risk than have dozens of miners and engineers impaired around heavy machinery. <laughs> See, if these require higher level access. Okay. Hi. How's it going? Okay, bye. Okay. They don't want me to have power nodes. They don't want me to be powerful. They. Them. They are coming. I think it says. They are coming. Well, that sounded gross. Alright, here we go. Please don't lean on glass. Our bash. Yeah, I don't know what that was, but I'm taking it. I have a gold semiconductor. Hello, space. I think I got everything of it. Oh, wait. I'm like, oh shit, how far from the door do I have to get before it closes? I, <laughs> I thought I had timed out my use of oxygen well, but that was, uh, you know. Going zero G. Darn. 
turning on though, so it'll be less dark. Okay, we move around 0G the way we did in 2. Because in 1, you only had magnetic boots. So you can only hook yourself onto surfaces. You couldn't free fly like this. That looks like a body. The morgue. This is the zero G. Oh. This is the zero G therapy. Got it. These are the patients. I don't know where I came from. It tells me to go that way. Interesting how space bar doesn't make you go up and down. I keep trying to use it too, but you can't. Exiting zero gravity. Hello. Got him both. Still holding this position. What's happening there? <laughs> I found some hydrazine that should work on the barricade. I'm heading back there now. Be careful with that hydrazine. I'm not losing anyone else. Okay. Well, obviously I'm not going to die with the hydrazine. They wouldn't be giving me so much money if I was. Probably. Transplant credits. I'm sure there'll be monsters in here. There they are. Damn it. Oh, that hurt. of the medium. What the hell? It shut the whole ship. I'll check it out. Hmm. Entering vacuum. Ah. That's nice. Because they didn't have the free fly before you, uh, in the original game, you just had to go back the same way you came. But now that they have free fly, they can cut off that one and make you go this way. That's neat. Grab me some oxygen. Grab me some plasma energy. Looks like they've still mostly got enclosed, so I can't go 
fuck myself out into space. Yeah. All cats are a good invention. Space. Battery space. Yes. Now we can family. Right, this is level one. I'm level one, right? <laughs> Alrighty then. Security clearance required. <sighs> well, someday I'll get a security clearance. the pulse gun but I've I, I used it a little bit in two and it was the butts so I just don't feel like spending the inventory space on it especially now that it's going to take up inventory space like at least before you'd be like well I can have whatever four guns and not care I just need to determine how much space I'm spending on ammunition for each of those four guns. Alright, that was a little messy. A little messy. <laughs> Got two of them in one go. That's what we get. Pop that out. Because I've been getting jumped by those jumpers more lately.
Find Captain Matthias's body. Get his rig codes, and the computer's all ours. I don't like that. They find power nodes infrequently enough, locking them behind that security clearance horse shiz. What? Look at this ship. Wait. Got a hologram going on there. I just know I'm gonna make some friends in here. Oh yeah. Security clearance required. I keep feeling like I've somehow missed security clearance level one, like I should already have it. Let's see, Warwick again. Harris is asleep after another dose of sedative. He seems literally unable to sleep without chemical aid. Most of the people, most people succumb to exhaustion after more than 50 hours of waking, regardless of circumstances. Not Harris. The bizarre explanation of events on the colony points to the same paranoia we've seen elsewhere planet side. His guilt is not in doubt. Two security officers were present when he took uh, Dr. Shirello hostage and murdered Nurse Evans, and Harris doesn't deny his actions, but he shows no remorse. In fact, he insists there was no crime. Specifically, that Evans wasn't a nurse when he killed her. This is classic sociopathic behavior, but Harris exhibits no other symptoms. He's affable and friendly, able to empathize and offer original opinions. When questioned about Evans' murder, however, he becomes withdrawn and uncommunicative. Uh, and he claims the explanation is stuck in his mind, and that talking about it mixes up its message. He also undergoes intermittent hallucinatory periods, again, similar to those experienced by other colonists. During his long waking periods, Harris exhibits writing, writing behavior on any available surface, claiming the dreams need to speak, and that he is attempting to make it whole again. What that means, I haven't determined yet. Given the complexities of this case, I plan to reach out to my colleagues for more insight. Oof. That went poorly for them. Oh. Move and transmit all personnel. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan. Medical is overwhelmed. We need help. Look at his wounds. We can't handle so many trauma cases, and the command crew won't tell us what's happening. Maybe I have some THP left. Follow Nicole's hologram. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, that ain't good. Medical log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. So much for being paranoid. I repurposed this room to run counseling sessions without unitologists interfering. Now, it's the only place I feel safe. I recovered a limb after yesterday's attack. Genetically, it's human tissue with bizarre mutations. But it's just a sample. It's not enough to figure out a cure. I need... Wait, where's that report from engineering? Oh, here. The engineers pulled something out of machinery. Limbs missing, torso intact. Okay. Time for a real autopsy. They added this whole bit. Like everything where you're following what Nicole was doing as this place was coming apart, that's all brand new. And I like it. Because in the first game, you're obviously looking for her, but it felt... underwhelming in how much it was about that. Like, you needed to fix this, fix that, get everybody off the ship. And there was that little... They would make little nods to it as the other characters would be like, I'm sure you'll find her. I'm sure she's there somewhere. I'm sure she's fine. Um, but this brings the focus back to what Nicole was doing. Brings the focus back to finding Nicole. And I think that's good. Ah, that was a stasis pod. Security oh, clearance. Eat my ass. I need an energy cell for the door is open. Nice. Fucking security again. I wonder if the security levels are like playthroughs or something. That'd be weird. It's like, I'm security level zero because I've only played through once. And then you know, on a second playthrough, I'll be security level one and be able to... That would be dumb. I don't... I don't think I would like that. I hope it's something else. Shit. How can we be sure that's not her? know about her is that she's blonde and a doctor. Any of these? I'll flip this back real quick. Because I just want this also open. Okay. I'm gonna make sure I had something important. Lights. 
shit. Okay. That's not good. The arrangement of this area is different. That I really don't like. Another security clearance door. Because the game hates me. Let's grab this. Vlad. Where'd my impaler go? Sir, 
surgery, so I left this with Warwick. Yeah. This is discreet. I just got the latest report from Agent 7. The situation's worse than Captain Matthias will admit. 40% of the colony's population is now showing symptoms. Depression, hallucinations, more violence. People are dying down there. I know it's linked to the marker somehow, but I just don't have enough data. Mercer, maybe I was wrong. We need answers by any means possible. That patient, Brad Harris, might be our last hope. Well, at least now I've got a power node. Hooray. I lost my impaler. Oop. Who are you? Oh, no. Stop that. Stop that. Why? He was fine. You killed him. Okay, then. God, everybody around here is crazy. Is that a security? <gasps> yeah. Oh, like there's a dead baby. Given that we're at like two and a half hours, and Sunday, I'll call it there for now. We've already gotten to see lots of little ways that they added um, to the story to just kind of uh, bring you deeper into the actually looking for Nicole. Like, it felt like such a side story uh, in the first game, which was unfortunate. You know, you wanted to really feel for Isaac and want to be looking for Nicole, but just everything guided you away from that, and they really made just very little mention of it throughout. So it's much nicer that you'll actually see it being like, oh, I need to go do this thing to fix this thing, and then you'll get a piece of information about Nicole. It's like, you know what? We're going to put that one on hold. We're going to try and find out more about Nicole. It's like, that's seems like how Isaac would prioritize things. So I'm very much enjoying that. Obviously it looks very pretty and it's running very well on the, my fast hard drive. So I'm very pleased with everything. Uh, so I'll come back and I'll do some more later. Chicago Zero out.